came across a recent online forum where one user posed this question. How should you politely refuse a request from your boss when they task you with something that is not part of your job description? <laughs> yeah. For example, how would you respond if your boss asked you to bring them coffee when that's not part of your job description? Ladies? Um, would you like me to tell your assistant that? Yeah. I'll relay it to your assistant. Yeah. I, I actually one. would say that. And if it was something like, because I feel like the first time you do it, if you do it, he's gonna ask you again or she's yes. gonna ask you again. And if it's something, you know, like can you stop at the store on your way home, I'll be like, you know, respectfully, I have to tell you that this is really not in my job description. I hope you can respect that. And that's not what I do. Yeah, I think the key is to pretty much say that that is taking away from the actual job that you do have. Oh. That's it. And be like, hey, I just want to clarify. I know that, like, I was asked to do this, but, like, if I'm doing that, then I can't really do the thing that I was hired to do. Like, as I was going and getting you the coffee, I yeah. wasn't at my desk for the 30 minutes. I actually yes. needed to sit down and get yeah. it. So I just want to clarify what it is that you are requiring from Good. me. Good. I would it. do that, and I would also add, just in case, because what if you get relieved of the other duty you want to do because they want you to go pick up their dry cleaning? Like, you know, I think there needs yeah. to be something to cement that you don't do that. Like, actually, I'm still on that project that I originally was assigned to do, but let me find the right person that should be doing that for you. What about, it's Ooh. not my job description. I respect. Because that causes a little. Uh, that, yeah, because that gives a power struggle. Yes, yes. And remember, anytime somebody asks you to do something that's not in your job descript, Is that's it a, a test? test. It's a test. Really? Because it's a, it's a little way to see if you're the type that would actually go do that. Yeah. You know what I mean? If you're the type, because then you can you can tether the line a little bit. Oh, oh absolutely. Yeah. Well, I'm I'm what would you? Oh, I cannot test. wait. I cannot <laughs> wait. I failed this test. What? You go. Every time. Well, I used to fail this test. We used to fail this test. I used to fail it for my own equals. I would go do things that I shouldn't be doing. Lonnie, what would you I say? The test. You know, I do. I say okay, oh. and I come back the next day with the coffee. <laughs> It would be cold. Oh, they don't want you to do that you job. You gotta no more. drink it. They ain't gonna want me to do it, right? right. right. That's right. actually don't do really right. smart. You say you want the coffee, right? Yeah. You know, that way you ain't got that. I feel like the whammy of all of that together is to do the job terribly <laughs> and be like, I'm so sorry, I grabbed your coffee, but I was busy doing the other job, <laughs> so it's cold now. But uh, girl, I be no. jam packed with that job you gave me. I'm too much of a G to do things right. I don't need you to look down on me on something that I'm gonna fake for your comfort. No. No, you didn't fake it. It's just you got caught up doing your actual job. Mm. Yeah, but you're saying to go fake that you couldn't get a cup of coffee back to this person decent. <laughs> That's faking it. No, like, make it wrong. Make it wrong. Right. Like, here's your coffee. I know, but be I'm glad. So, really, I'm not good at this. Put I just be doing a job and be grateful to be there. <laughs> <laughs> Put some salt in this coffee. Oh, I don't want you to go get them. Not salt. You <laughs> uh, they you they guys, check you this out. I came across a recent tweet from rapper Tory Lane that stated, sometimes the best revenge is healing yourself. Tell Ladies, more about it. what are your thoughts on this? Jeannie, how do you feel about this? <laughs> Anything Tory Lane says, I'm just like, <laughs> it just sounds like a wambulance to me. <laughs> <laughs> a wambulance. Get this doesn't here. sound like healing to me, this tweet, but OK. I, I mean, I think you got to heal yourself before you can do anything. Agreed. Right? I mean, I don't know what he was referring to. I still think healing comes in the form of tweets. You don't think so? Yeah, I think he's saying this on a, on a whole lot on, of this. I said on a gotcha. Twitter. He's saying this on a Twitter. <laughs> and no, I think he's saying this on Twitter. <laughs> but but I, I actually think that if there was real healing happening, you wouldn't even feel the need to post these things on Twitter. What was the but tweet But I think again? it is very true. The tweet was, uh, real, uh, real revenge is healing. Real revenge is uh, is, is living your best revenge. life. It's not wanting revenge. It's living your best life. You don't have yeah. to go after it. Just moving you're forward. You're not thinking about it. Just you're not forward. subtweeting. When you're healing, you're not even thinking about <laughs> this yeah. in, in place of real revenge. There's you so are not many thinking, jokes. oh, I'm a heal? It's because that's the revenge. No, <laughs> the healing is not even wanting revenge. The healing yeah. is you not even thinking about you not even thinking about that person. You have healed from it. You've moved on. You're moving forward. Yes, and living your best life. <laughs> Life. They yes. say the sweetest revenge is success. So that's I was all gonna it is. say uh, to me, the best revenge is a bag in my bank. Like that's all it is. That's I don't, success. I don't need. That's I don't right. need you to heal. The like, greatest I'm revenge make to me money. is indifference. I'm not yeah. even thinking about you or how mm. you feel about what I'm doing. Like yeah. I just, I, you are not even a thought in my mind. Mm. All right, let's move on to this one. Um, 
Now, this is a good one. I came across an online discussion where one user posed this question. Why do I spend weeks avoiding tasks that will take me 10 minutes to Lord, do? Lord, One me. user responded with, I replaced an outside bulb yesterday. It only took me three minutes to change it. It's burned out two this years is me. ago. This is me. So ladies, what task have you been avoiding for the longest time and finally ready to do? I am the greatest procrastinator. Are you? Yes, last minute packing. I don't like packing, so I always pack last minute, and then you realize you need alterations. You gotta pick up some black shorts to go with that top. Like, yeah. all these things I put on top yeah. of myself. I don't know why I do it. I actually don't, and it's a habit I want to break. Yeah. Like, organizing, yeah. worst ever at yeah. doing that. Appointments to go do checkups, like things you're supposed to do. Yeah. Guys, let me ask you an honest question. We're just gonna keep it real here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Have you been in the dentist since COVID? Yes. yes. Mm. See? That's yeah. why I'm over here. That's yes. why I gotta go get these molars checked. Well, I went to the dentist because during our, when COVID first, first started, this is very random. What? I think you guys knew this. Um, when we were just in our bedrooms with our laptops before the actual virtual season, um, one of my veneers popped off. Oh, wait, right and here, And I was right? gluing it, this one. Oh, yeah, yeah. I was gluing it on <laughs> with freaking nail glue. I, I had to go to the dentist and then- I remember I, that. I had just moved to Calabasas, so I ended up going to Calabasas Dentistry. They ended up doing my cleanings, and it was all great. But I, I would go very frequently. Yes, but it originally yeah. started because of an emergency. I'm I used just to the go worst quarterly. person. You know what, like this, that'll still be there. <laughs> <laughs> No way. That piece of paper will <laughs> still be there. Yeah. It only yeah, takes you two seconds to pick up that piece yep, of paper. Right. Yep. And I will be like, woo. Yep. <laughs> that is crazy. Yeah. For you me, guys, my biggest procrastination.